you welcome back to Mac Pressy channel and in this channel you learn how to do a lot of things we are going to learn how to do tick bleach or tick parazo so in my bucket here I'm going to be mixing about 17 liters of parazo I've already done down and I'll be using it for the tick parazo when you check my videos, you will see how to do parazo, pure quality parazo. I have my ingredients here a lot, so please don't mind. And um, in here, I have 700 gram of um, salt and 850 gram of base. So we'll be mixing it together the way you start a liquid soap process. You mix it together so it becomes fluffy. No. So you mix this way for about seven to ten minutes. You see it has gathered. It's becoming very whitish. You continue mixing for some time. So as it's like this now, I've been mixing for a while. Now I will start adding my already made parazo that I filtered down. I will start adding it a little by little. As you add, you mix. So I'm going to add two liters, then I mix. You mix it till it smoothens up before you add. If not, if you just mix it halfway, it's still lumpy and you add more liquid. By the time you know, it will all be lumpy and it will not be smooth. So we are still mixing with the two liters of water because the lumps have not yet dissolved well in it. It must dissolve before you continuously add. And as you add, it will be thickening up. It will be thickening up. So you add the whole 17 liters of parazo. So as you can see in the video, it's thickening up. And I'm still mixing. I'm adding more because as you can see, it has smoothened up. I'll be adding about 4 liters. Then I mix. So that is how you add and you mix. I'm adding the fourth one, then I mix. I'll be adding and mixing, adding and mixing, adding and mixing. So we've added the whole 17 liters of parazo, and you see it's very smooth and it's heavy. It's heavy. As you can see, it's heavy. It can be as heavy as a liquid soap, but it's not light as a normal parazo. So this is how to do thick parazo. You mix well. Everything you do, mixing well is the key to getting a perfect answer. I want to tell you a secret that every chemical, make sure you mix for at least 30 minutes. 30 minutes with that every every is mixed in it from beginning to start to be 30 minutes you can even make it 40 minutes but sometimes some of the chemicals when you mix it too much it become watery so 30 minutes is okay it's very good it's very heavy for use as parazo now i'll be going in with some perfume i just want to give him some give it some perfume to give it some nice smell, you know. <laughs> so, I've added my perfume. It will look yellow in it because that's perfume for you. And when you mix it, you see that the yellow color is gone. Hooray! So, you mix well. Hmm, this smells good. This puzzle 
when you use it to just suck your dresses. Believe you me, I am dire. <laughs> it's gonna smell worry. So that is it for thick parazo. The last time when I did my videos, I people said they should have seen the thick parazo. I showed from the beginning of the video how the uh, parazo is. And when you fetch it down, then you mix. And this is how it looks. It's heavy, very heavy. And I've added some perfume to boost a scent. So that it does not have that strong caustic soda parazo. Thanks for tuning in. God bless you for always passing by. Love you. All the best. Mwah, mwah, mwah. To show for my subscribers and blessed, blessed to all who like, share, and subscribe. Much love. Watch out for more. Thank you.